Electric tractors may be the next electric vehicle growth market, reports Chris Cathy in Yahoo Finance and Benzinga. Let's take a look at that, friends. Welcome back, everyone. This is Armin Haryan from TorqueNews.com. If you are here for the first time, please subscribe to our channel for daily Tesla and electric vehicle news and ring the bell so you don't miss my next Tesla story. So the electric vehicle market has transformed from focusing on sedans to a market that now is tackling trucks vans and long-range semis suvs in fact mercedes is just announced that they, they're going to build six or eight new electric vehicles and uh, hyundai has announced that they're building i think four major investments in the area of electric vehicles and i'm not even toyota announced that they're uh, bringing host of electric vehicles in the next several years now could tractors be the next now Ideanomics entry, Ideanomics entry, small cap company Ideanomics invests in fine tech and electric vehicle companies. In November, Ideanomics increased its stake in Sol Solec Truck, one of its portfolio companies, to 24%. We would like to play an important part, CEO Alf Poor said while speaking at the Benzinga Global Small Cap Conference this past week. In a release announcing the increased stake, Poor said Solec Truck, quote, has enormous potential and given the uptick in both product inquiries and investment interest, they are seeing we exercised our right to increase our stake so we can help Solec Truck scale to meet anticipated market demand. End of the quote. About Solec Truck, the global agricultural tractor industry is worth $75 billion. Solec Truck claims to be the first North American company to offer a 100% battery powered all electric tractor. So remember this company, Solec Truck. I didn't know about this company before this report, but they are huge. The company offers three electric tractor models with a fourth in the design stage. The e-utility tractor has a sales price of $45,000 in North America and $49,500 internationally. So for $45,000, you can um, buy the e-utility electric tractor from Solec Truck and, and do your work as an electric tractor. The e-utility has a battery that lasts from four to eight hours and can be charged to 80% in three hours. Ideanomics is pitching electric tractors at affordable price points to make them attractive to small markets and the larger global market. The company is working with OEMs to bring larger tractors to market in North America and Europe, Poor said at the Benzinga Global Spoke Cap Conference. Solec Truck's home state of California is responsible for 12.5% of U.S. agricultural production, Poor wrote in a company letter in October. The company can take advantage of Ideanomics China operations to lower costs and make the motor and battery supply chain more effective, he said. The future of electric tractors has never looked brighter, poor road. Now, sizing up competition. Solid truck isn't the only player in this space. Monarch Tractors, about which I'm going to tell in a moment, which unveiled a, a new drivetrain, Monarch Tractor plans to bring a fully electric autonomous tractor to market in 2021. The Monarch Tractor comes with a starting price of $50,000 and Electric uh, calls the tractor a game-changing smart electric tractor <clears throat> with the driver uh, with the driver optional so um here's what it said said as if we need and more evidence that electric vehicles are taking over essentially every form of vehicle monarch tractor and now is announcing several days ago a new all-electric tractor however the term tractor doesn't seem sufficient to describe this technology infused and autonomous all-in-one farm tool says electric the electric also says we have seen concepts of for electric tractors thrown around heavy waders like john deere before but the electric uh, monarch tractor 
isn't just an electric version of a typical farm-based hauling machine. It looks really nice. Um, and yes, it is uh, still a workhorse for with a small footprint powered by 55 kilowatt 70 um, uh, horsepower peak rated motor and offering twice the torque of a comparable diesel power tractor. But it's also loaded with technology designed to make farming both safer and more efficient not to mention more sustainable. The Monarch tractor can be driven like a typical tractor but is also designed to operate autonomously, autonomously, which I said driver is optional, as well as part of a fleet of robotic tractors. Operators can program tasks and jobs ahead of time to be performed automatically or automation features like gesture and shadow can be used to follow workers on the job. Electric also says that while the gravity of that capability might not be quite as appreciable to those of us that haven't worked a farm, consider what that means. Nearly as easily as you might send your Roomba off to clear your apartment or home while you're out, a farmer can send his tractor out to the fields to work alone while he's you know doing something else in his farm and the monarch tractor isn't just a smart tractor it's actually a three-in-one farm tool in addition to its tractor duties it can also be reconfigured as an atv and it serves as a powerful electrical generator in the field you can whip out your arc welder and perform repairs using the tractor as a power source Electric also reports that the Monarch tractor relies on a deep learning and sensing suite to operate safety and efficiently. It includes 360 degree cameras and other uh, sensors to avoid collisions or rolls and collects and analyzes over 240 gigabyte of crop data every day that it operates in a field. So as you can see, by using machine learning, the Monarch tractor analyzes this data to provide long-term analysis of the health of uh, fields and crops, continuously improving accuracy the longer it operates. On tractor controls, uh, controls include um, a touchscreen display, while farmers can also operate the tractor remotely using a smartphone or personal device. So back to our report, another one uh, besides Monarch is the CNH Industrial, which is working on clean energy offering in the tractor market. The company has a zero emission electric backhaul called Project Zeus, and it, um, it is also looking to power some vehicles with hydrogen. Another one is Deer and Company, which has Deer and Company has shown off several prototypes of electric or autonomous tractors over the years, but hasn't released hard figures on costs or release date. And, uh, uh, shares of Ideanomics are up recently of 140% year to date, giving a signal that the investment in electric tractors is probably is a prospective thing. I don't know. What do you guys think in uh, about electric tractors or self-driving tractors or using your tractor as an electric tractor as a powerhouse to do some work in your farm and also sending your tractor to analyze data in the farm and doing the work in itself while you're doing something else in your house. I think this is very exciting. Friends, let me know what your thoughts are. This is Armin Haryan from TorqueNews.com. Please subscribe to our channel for daily tests Tesla news and ring the notification bell so you don't miss my next Tesla story. I'll look forward to hearing your comments about electric tractors, especially if you guys, any of you are just, uh, are guys uh, farmers or working on a farm. So have a wonderful day.